Send a bottle of Johnny Walker Blue to Jonathan Palmer and get him tickets to the next Sox game. And then find out when his wife's birthday is, his kid's birthday, his dog's birthday. How am I supposed to do I don't care how you do it, figure it the hell out. Harvey, this is a thank you to him. Why are you so mad at me? It's not a thank you. It's an apology for you talking me into getting him to give Lewis a job. What did he He didn't even show up to the interview. And what's happening with our VersaLife problem? I'm all over it. Yeah, all over it means you don't have d Next time I see you, have something. What? I'm gonna tell you something, and I don't want you to overreact. From the look on your face, I'm not making any promises. I just got an email from Lewis. He's going after Bursa Life. Get me Ray. What are you gonna do? Get me Ray. Harvey, it was just a notification email. You don't even know where he is. Yes, I do. What are you talking about? That notification is required by the bylaws. He's doing it at the last second. I guarantee you he's walking in Bursa Life's door right now. do you think you were doing? Not doing did. I just signed VersaLife. You have no right. Please, I have every right. Because when I quit, Jessica only notified my clients, not yours, because she didn't think I had enough balls to go after you head on. That wasn't her, that was me, because I didn't think you would stoop this low. Oh, too bad. You exposed your flank, now you're too late. Yeah, you can see the fear in my eyes. Excuse me. I told you, you're too late. To tell them an unemployed clown just sold them a pile of You mean the bull that you have to drop them as a client? The Pfizer merger, FTC rule 10B6. They were not pleased that you kept them in the dark. You are a son of a bitch. Who's the clown now? You're a son of a bitch. I'm only taking one client that you're gonna have to drop anyway. The least you could do is be a gentleman about it. A gentleman? I got you two jobs. Two jobs in Siberia. What a pity. I got you those jobs out of compassion. Just like when I fought for Jessica to not fire you in the first place. But when I take VersaLife back, it's gonna be without any feeling for you at all. It was me. What was you? Lewis going after them is my fault. What did you do? I went to Robert Zane and I asked him to give Lewis a job. That's it? You didn't tell him about Versa Life. Of course not. You think I would do that? Never mind what I think. You went to one of our biggest competitors and put him together with a desperate Lewis. I did it because Lewis was desperate, all right? I went to see him the other day to bring him the a The other day? Him. You're telling me when you were supposed to be helping us keep our client, you were busy giving them to Lewis on a silver platter? I was, but I also figured out how to get them back. Why didn't you tell me then? Because I was trying to think of a better option. What the hell's wrong with this option? It involves going to Walter Gillis. who decided to drop by. The man who lost me, my company, and his partner who tore it to shreds. Walter, I understand how you must feel. So why are you here? Because we have a proposition for you. Does it involve an apology? It is an apology. You want me to buy VersaLife? We want you to buy a division of VersaLife. The division that makes that drug. They've been working on anti-addiction meds for years. Look at the results. This one works. But it's a money loser and it's gonna take years. They don't have the capital, the patience, or the will. But you do. And let me guess, you two are here out of the goodness of your hearts. Do you want the truth? He'd be here whether this was for his own good or not. For me, I'm here because it gets me out of a jam. So you can stick it to us if you want to, but if you do that, you're gonna miss the chance to save a lot of other people just like Philip. Don't ever talk to me about Philip again. Walter. No, this is how all this started, with you using my son. No, I'm the one who used your son. I used him to get control of your company, but everything Mike did from the second he met you was to save your company. Because when it comes to caring about people, he's twice the man that I am. And by the way, he never gave up on you and he never sold you out. You're right, it is. Mike, no. The truth is, is that I gave you my word, I told you I would never sell you out, and then I got into bed with someone that I never should have trusted, and I lost you your company. Yes, you did. And that company was your family. It gave you purpose, but you still have money, and this is a purpose. Walter, if you don't want to do this, I get it. But I need you to understand that the only reason I even thought to come to you in the first place is that I'm gonna regret what I did to you for the rest of my life.